Sean, uh, <clears throat> Adam Ashley Cooper has never lost against Wales in 13 matches. I've noticed following you over the last six months that there's a very different change in approach. That perhaps it's not necessarily a Welsh thing that you're saying, yes, we are here to win the World Cup. We are here to be confident. Is that something that you've had to drill into the players, that they buy into this difference in Welsh mentality that's maybe hamstrung? Harmed us at the last World Cup, sorry, the World Cup in 2011. I thought we did outstandingly well at that World Cup. And the last World Cup, you know, we lost in the last second against South Africa, which we went on to lose by two points against the All Blacks. So I think we've performed quite well at World Cups. Um, as regards, as regards as saying we're going to win the World Cup, that's never really been our approach. Our approach is win the next game. And obviously the next game is for us is uh, against Australia. And uh, we're going into it, as I said, pretty well prepared, uh, going against a formidable opponent. And uh, let's get it on. So, so the confidence has not really changed in the last decade. You think that this, as a nation... Well, it's changed. It's definitely changed. It changed with winning. And obviously we went on a 60, was it 14 game winning run? That brings confidence. And what, what winning does, it, the players have confidence in, in, in what you're trying to implement into the game. So if you want to have a soft defence on the edge and, and you're winning, well, the players will buy into it because they're winning. And uh, all the things we've done recently, because we obviously we've got a, a tremendous winning run, uh, the players are buying into our tactics you know, greatly. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos like this. And don't forget to hit the bell icon for our latest content.